Welcome back. DJ Vic Weber here. So let's move on with uh, some arrangement. Uh, I'm going to copy this. And we're going to duplicate it. And I think that should just about be enough for this little exercise. So let's see. Usually start off with a kick and a clap. And I think we can take this guy out. We don't need it to come in quite yet. And again, we don't need this guy yet. Just get a good segment there. Cord out for now. Don't need the cord. That should give us a nice start. Let's see what we've got. Yeah, it sounds good. I guess I can live with that. So one of the things I always like to do uh, when I'm working on my projects is to kind of include or put all my drum parts or drum elements on a bus channel or a group channel or whatever your usually re your preference is to refer to that, usually bus or group. So let's take a look at uh, busing or grouping drum parts. going to go over here and we're going to uh, bring up our in outs and let's take a look at everything. All right, so just kind of bear with me. I keep forgetting I, when I solo, it actually takes the microphone away from us as well. So we have the three drum elements here, and what I'd like to do is get them all going to the same bus or same channel. So let's see what channels we actually have available. And doesn't look like we have any available. So let's create one. Right click audio track and of course we can rename that if we choose bus so now if I go back over to my drum parts I'm gonna tell it right now it's got audio from the kick going to the master I would like that to go to the bus select bus same with the clap it's going to the master we're gonna send it to the bus and our top loop, we are also sending that audio to the bus. So now in effect, we've got one channel controlling all three of our drum elements. bus channel, if we double click on the top, 
gives us the option to go ahead and put some effects here. Let's take a look at that. Maybe a little compression. Sounds like a good idea. So I'll get a little compression, give it a little punch, give it a little attitude. That is creating a bus in Bitwig Studios. Let's move on to the next video.